19th of December. It is six days until Christmas. I have a class in, I don't know what time it is. Let's check. I have a class in half an hour. It's about half past nine now. I've been up since seven because I had some marking to do. Um, and the power's out. So that's gonna be fun. Um, but yeah, this week, uh, just because it is the week of Christmas, I thought I would film a little video just showing what Christmas is like in Myanmar. I filmed a video last year on Christmas Day showing what Christmas was like for me in China. So I thought it'd be interesting to have both of them for my memories. And also if anyone was interested in what Christmas was like here in Myanmar too, um, you can watch this video and you can see how we're celebrating Christmas in a pandemic and in Myanmar. So that might be interesting. I don't know. We'll see. Um, yeah, I'm just going to film bits and bobs throughout this week. Um, sorry for anyone who's superstitious. I have already put my calendar up, uh, but... I'm not superstitious and I don't think it's bad luck, so it's fine. And it's not on January, it's just on the cover page, um, so I think we're okay. But yeah, I hope this week is interesting, I hope the power comes back on and I will take you along on Christmas in Myanmar. Let's go! <laughs> come back on thank goodness it came back on about like halfway through the first half of my first class um so now i'm having lunchtime i think the last clip you saw was actually break time i didn't really film much in class because it's just online you've all seen that before um in my other videos so i didn't think it was really that interesting um but yeah so now i'm gonna have my lunch i have about an hour break between my class now and my listening and speaking class but we're doing christmas I just realized how messy my desk looks, but ignore that. Um, so I'm doing weird Christmas traditions around the world. And also they're then going to pick a country in the world and research their Christmas traditions from, from that country. And they'll present that tomorrow. So it's like a two day lesson from a listening and speaking class today. Um, and I'm kind of doing a similar vibe with all my listening and speaking classes. Um just because it's on the theme of Christmas and it's very easy to adjust the level to make it more difficult for the pre-intermediates, easier for the elementary and somewhere in between for the young learners because the young learners are about elementary to pre-intermediate, they're a bit more of a mix. So yeah, we're basically doing kind of like a Christmassy themed research presentation lesson for all my listening and speaking classes um, over the next couple of days. Um, and then I have my uh, beyond a ones in the afternoon from 3 till 5 p.m. And I think I'm watching a Christmas movie in the evening. So that's pretty much all for Saturday. <laughs> Saturday and now I have a quick meeting um, which shouldn't take too long and then I'm going to relax maybe wrap some presents and watch a Christmas movie I think I'm gonna watch Christmas Chronicles so yeah being a good Saturday apart from the power going out always fun <laughs> me and my problems this was for an activity um, which you might have seen a clip of um, uh, just a minute ago. Um, basically I was reading uh, instructions and they had to draw what I was reading so this is what this is what they should have ended up with. We got some interesting interpretations. I was gonna try and take a picture but then I forgot because we were just laughing too much. Um, but yeah that was a fun lesson with my adults and then my young learners. Um, I've just commissioned them to write a Christmas story for next week and then we're gonna read them on Boxing Day because uh, I'm working on Boxing Day. Um, so yeah, we're going to have a bit of a fun lesson next week. So, yeah. Good morning. It is 
now, I almost said Tuesday. It's not Tuesday, it's Sunday. <laughs> um, it's Sunday the 20th of December. I'm just editing a video before I start class. I have class in about 10 minutes. Um, so I have three classes again today, uh, two young learners and my listening is being class with my adults. And yeah, just having a look at what I need to do over the next couple of weeks and trying to organize myself because I've not been very organized at all, apart from the fact that I finished my Christmas shopping, which is not hard when you've only got three people to buy for. So yeah, perks of living abroad. <laughs> don't have to buy many presents. Um, but yeah, so we'll just see what happens today. I don't think today's gonna be very long in terms of content. Um, but yeah, since I was decided to film this week, I thought I would just hop on and say good morning and happy Tuesday. Santa is still on my board. We'll see what my young learners have to say about that when I log on. I'm kind of taking a relaxed approach to my lesson today. I have a plan of what we need to get through today. We actually have to really get through a lot of content in the textbook. Um, but it is the week before Christmas. I know some of my students celebrate Christmas, some do not. Some are Buddhist, some are Christian. Um, so we will just be seeing how it goes today. I'm not going to really rush them until after New Year. Um, and then we're going to have to power through the book because we've got lots to get through before the exam. So yeah, let's do Sunday, not Tuesday, Sunday. <laughs> pasta with sweet chili sauce and feta cheese with a salad on the side. Um, now I'm just having salad because I didn't have time to cook pasta because it's now like 20 minutes till my class starts uh, after I spent all that time cleaning it up. And also um, I kind of needed the sweet chili sauce for the pasta and the whole thing was ruined because it was full of glass. Um, yeah. Very sad about that. I just bought that bought jar of sweet chili sauce. It's from Kukoya and they're on Christmas break, so I can't order another one for two weeks. Um, and it's the best sweet chili sauce. Like, honestly, it's so good. And it's broken, and I didn't even get to have any of it. So now I'm gonna have to go get regular old store sweet chili sauce because I cannot live that long without sweet chili sauce. Um, so, what we have instead for today is a salad with feta cheese, beetroot pesto, sriracha, and a little bit of garlic oil, and a banana, because I needed the extra, the e extra food to make up for the pasta. <laughs> ah. Clearly did not get enough sleep last night, and I just dropped my phone. Yes, I'm also drinking Coke for um, lunch, because I need the caffeine, and I don't like coffee, so bye-bye. <laughs> of the day and then I am 100% having a nap because I also need a lesson plan after this so a nap is needed before any more work gets done so last class is two hours long and it's from textbook and we have a presentation to do for that as well they're doing a presentation about what to do in an earthquake and then I'm having a nap and then I am lesson planning and then I have to maybe make some chocolate strawberries because we have movie night this evening um so yeah let's get into the final class of the weekend and then i have three more days of classes before holiday well not holiday my day is off for thursday friday but before christmas let's go <laughs>
I can't, I still, I've been working Saturday to Wednesday for so long and I still can't wrap my head around what day it is. Um, yeah, just had a pretty chill morning finalizing my lesson plan for today. And my class starts in about, oh, I forgot what time it is, maybe like 10, 15 minutes. Um, so yeah, just going to check Zoom is working because sometimes my camera does not work. Um, so I need to check that's working. And then I have my youngest class, my level twos. Um, so they're about eight to 10 years old and they're also the lowest level I have. So um, level twos is, is quite um, pretty much beginner. Um, so today we're doing animals at the zoo in their textbook. Um, we use the Superminds books. So yeah, let's do Monday. It's not Wednesday, it's Monday. Today is Monday. <laughs> hello, hello, how are you? present just came which is next Monday it's my birthday so I ordered myself a little birthday present and it just arrived from Eden which is a jewelry company here in Myanmar and they work with victims of sex trafficking uh, to give them a skill and a job so this is my birthday present to me <laughs> morning I uh, got an exciting delivery coming after this class though which I can't wait for um, but I'm also gonna have to not do anything with until Christmas because I'm ordering it for Christmas so I need to have some self-restraint <laughs> but yeah I gotta get back to class because break time is almost over and I'll catch up with you after this class and that is a really loud crow <laughs> Exciting delivery is here. It's maybe not very exciting if you don't live outside of the UK and if you are not celiac, but for me it's very exciting. So my flatmate found wait, a Facebook page that sells imported UK snacks and things and one of those things was gluten-free chocolate chip cookies, but also we're having a cheese board on Christmas day. So now I have some oat cakes, nairns, we love nairns. And also, of course, you can't have a Christmas day without hot chocolate. So we've got options, hot chocolate. Mm, I'm so excited. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> I feel like my videos are only in this corner of the room <laughs> and I've not really gone anywhere else which is kind of what's happened all week I haven't been anywhere apart from in this corner of my room teaching um, but I just had to have a nap it was a good nap but last night I didn't talk about it but I, I know there's a couple of clips um, from yesterday uh, McFly had their um, Christmas with McFly and it was like 2.30 a.m my time because it was 8 p.m uk time so i stayed up for that and i'm really sleepy today um so i had to just have a nap before my listening and speaking young learner class 
which is starting in about 15 minutes. So today I'm giving them their research question. They're going to go and research that um, for today and then tomorrow they'll do their presentations. Um, so like I said previously, I think I said on Saturday or Sunday, um, it's going to be a pretty similar lesson to the pre-intermediate class. They are going to be researching a country and the traditions of Christmas that, that country has. But I'm also giving them a bonus fact that they need to find out. So um, for today, I think I'm going with uh, why people have Christmas trees and also um, what the reason for stockings is and maybe where Santa Claus comes from. I'm not sure yet. I've not completely decided what their bonus facts are going to be, but there'll be three groups and each group will have a bonus fact that they have to find out and they'll have to share that with the rest of the class tomorrow. Um, so yeah. I need to wake up a little bit. I'm still a bit sleepy from my nap. Um, and then I'm going into my elementary listening and speaking class this evening as well, which starts about half an hour after. Um, my young learner singing and speaking class. So yeah, don't get much of a break between the two, but I've got two hour break between my level twos and my young learner listening and speaking. So it's not so bad. Um, but yeah, okay, gotta get into class. <laughs> Wednesday, two days until Christmas, my last day of work. Um, yesterday was a bit of a non-day. I was really tired basically because I stayed up super late to watch the McFly Christmas show. Um, so yeah, I don't know if any of yesterday made sense. But today is my last day, I just have two classes. Um, the super young learners level two and then my listening and speaking class. Um, both Christmassy themed, so that'll be fun. And then it's Christmas! So tomorrow's a pretty busy day as well. So we'll see what happens. Um, it might be split into two videos. And um, we'll just wait and see how long this one ends up being, I think. I've been editing it as I go, like day by day, and it's already like nine minutes, so I don't want it to be too long. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go put my Christmas earrings on and my Christmas hat, and then it's time for level two. We're doing a story about Rudolph, singing Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeer, and writing about why we're special. So that should be cute. <laughs> um, and then my young learner listening speaking have presentations to do today. They're doing presentations about how Christmas is celebrated in different countries. I think they chose Germany, one group chose Russia, and I think one group chose Poland as well. So that should be interesting. We'll see how they go. And then have to wrap my friend Sam's Christmas presents um, because I'll see her tomorrow. Um, and that's about all my plans for today. Oh, maybe I should roast the chestnuts today too because I'm making nut roast tomorrow for Christmas Eve dinner. Um, we'll see. We'll see what we have time to do. <laughs> but yeah, let's go do level two. out can you guys hear me no <laughs> half an hour before my class finished and the power is going out classes are finished for the week which means I am officially on my weekend which very happily coincided with Christmas this year, so um, Thursday and Friday are my days off, which means I'm off for Christmas this year, unlike last year where I had to work on Christmas Day, um, so that is a bonus, but I do have to work on Boxing Day, which is Saturday, um, so we'll be taking it easy on the mulled wine, um, but yeah, it's officially Christmas, classes are finished, I had my Christmas hat on, which you might have seen in the previous clips for classes today. Um, and the power came back on. It wasn't off for too long. Uh, I can't believe it went off in the middle of their presentations. 
but never mind it came back and we managed to play a little Christmas quiz game at the end um, as well um, so it wasn't all work today which was good nice way to end the day um, so yeah now it's just time to chill and if this is the end of this video I hope you enjoyed my Christmassy teaching week from Saturday to Wednesday and the next video you see will be Christmas Eve and Christmas Day. So goodbye for now and <laughs> this might be the most um, frequent upload month I've ever done because I'm going to upload twice in a row. Um, we'll see. But yeah, I will see you in the next video. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed my Christmassy week in Myanmar. <laughs>